And then when you step back, step back and, and look at it from a distance, everything works out. Everything looks better from a distance than, than it does up close. So I'm waiting patiently, patiently for The Chosen Season 4 to come to the computer screen instead of the big screen. Patiently, patiently waiting. It's getting harder and harder to be patient. podcast that I've been listening to. Uh, the podcast is called Faith and Other Oddities. Let me see. Just want to make sure I got it right. Yeah, Faith and Other Oddities. Listening to them along with the Bottle Project, along with Bema, along with Two Trees, along with what else do I listen to? What else have I mentioned? And there's another podcast I've been listening to that is uh, more creative than it is about the Bible. Uh, it is called, what's the other one called? It's about, uh... oh yeah, it's called The Hero's Journey. So if you're a Star Wars fan, or if you're a Harry Potter fan, or if you're a Bible fan, uh, so... Uh, what's his name? George Lucas studied when he was studying film uh, he learned about uh, this hero's journey uh, written, by, written by 
the name escapes me. The name of the guy escapes me because uh, he's very important to Lucas storytelling, story writing. But um, there's a, a formula. There's a step-by-step -step formula that most, uh, you know, classical stories have followed throughout the generations, not only in the Bible, but in just about all cultures. So all great stories uh, follow this pattern. And uh, I cannot remember it off the top of my head, or else I would tell it to you, but um, some of the steps are they all, the, the hero starts out in the normal world. So if you think of uh, Luke Skywalker, uh, he's a, a farmer, a moisture farmer on the, on the planet Tatooine, and nothing happens there. Right? Nothing ever happens there. Um, Harry Potter is living in the Muggle world. He's uh, a step stepchild, and he is uh, treated badly. And then they're brought into the special world. Uh, I wanted to write a novel and do all three things, but I don't have the, the skill level in all three things. Maybe I should read more. Uh, I would I would recommend to listen to, uh, if you like podcasts, listen to the, the Hero's Journey podcast. Um, I can't remember the name of... Joseph Campbell, that's the name of the guy. So do some Googling, do, uh, Google Joseph Campbell, Google The Hero's Journey. Uh, there's also a Disney book about The Hero's Journey. And I can't remember the name of the title of that, but, but uh, if you want to write anything, uh, especially a novel or a story, I would definitely recommend checking out Joseph Campbell and The Hero's Journey. Everybody's doing it. And if you think you're not doing it, you're probably doing it anyway. If you're writing any kind of a story, uh, the rules are not hard and fast. They can be uh, more like guidelines rather than hard fast rules. Spread the gospel. We're on a mission from God. That needs to be a sound bite. I need to make that a sound bite. Note to self. Make that a sound bite. We're on a mission from God. Is that too old? Do people know the Blues Brothers? Do people know that movie? 